Have you purchased a brand new Amaze Fit watch and now wondering how can you connect it to Strava, Google Fit and Relive? If yes, then I have told you how you can do just that in this video. Besides telling you how to connect to other platforms, there is another reason for making this video. It is because not properly connecting accounts can lead to problems. For instance, missing heart rate data on Strava despite Zep account being connected. In this video, I'll tell you how you can properly connect your Zep account to Strava and make sure that your heart rate is also synced. So let's get into it. Open the Zep app on your smartphone, tap on the profile option and open the add accounts option here. On the next screen, you will find multiple platforms to which you can connect your Zep account. Tap on the Strava first. This will take you to the Strava landing page. Here you can log in with your existing account or sign up for a new one. I will be logging in as I already have a Strava account. After logging in, you will get a page where you will need to authorize Strava to access your data. Now all your walking, running or cycling sessions would be synced to Strava. However, our job isn't done yet. Now open the Strava app on your cell phone and if you don't have the app already, then install it. Once you are in the app, open the settings using the settings icon in the corner. Scroll down and look for the data permissions option. Tap on it. On the next screen, tap on the health related data option. A pop-up will appear to make sure it is set allow. If it is set to decline, your heart rate data won't sync to your Strava account. That's all you had to do and now all your activities will be synced to Strava. I will be now telling you how to connect your Zep account to Google Fit. On the account page, tap on Google Fit. Here, tap on Google username. This will bring a pop-up asking to select the Google account you want to connect the Zep account to. Select the account and now Google will ask for your consent to sync all your health vitals and other data. Tap on the allow and now you will find all your heart rate, sleep and workout data being synced to Google Fit app. I would definitely recommend connecting the Google Fit account as it offers support for widgets as well. Next up is Relive, which is another app similar to Strava. So first download and install the Relive app on your phone. On the add account page, tap on the Relive option. On the next page, tap on unbound. This should open a web page where you need to log in to Relive. After logging in, it should load a web page asking for permission to access your workout activities. Tap on allow and now your Relive profile is connected to your Amazfit or Zep account. So that's how you connect your Amazfit account to Strava, Relive or Google Fit. Pretty easy, right? So here is a question for all of my viewers. Which app do you prefer between Strava and Relive and why? Make sure to leave your answer in the comment box down below. If you liked this video and found this video to be helpful, then make sure to tell us by hitting the like button. Consider subscribing as we make various informational videos on smartwatches and watches. See you next time.